in the name of Allah, the most gracious, most merciful. This is very sad news like for all my Muslim brothers. They hurt non-believers. They use bad words for our prophets. All prophets, I mean, Jew and Christian and Hindu, always they not respect our prophets. Only Allah told us, you know, whenever prophets came in this earth, according to Quran, Allah says, they says Abraham, Prophet Abraham and some other prophets, they go with mother for sex. They go with daughter for sex. This kind of, you know, abuse always when the prophet in the set. So non-believers, they don't understand God is unseen like. And they worshipping idols, pagans. So they don't respect prophets. Today also, this is the big sign. That's why I want to be safe for my Muslim brothers. One guy, he left Islam. He was in Islam 14 years. And now he wants to be sure Quran 100% is not true like, that's not complete like, but he don't understand how come two years kid also can memorize. Seven year kids memorize, millions of, in this earth today, memorize Quran, how come? Other one is, suppose if Quran is not true, in reactions in Europe today, white girl or man, young boy and black young boy and Spanish young boy, girls, this is for, you know, sign like, I don't want to be, you know, say I'm, uh, hate white, black, or Spanish. No, this is sign for recognize these guys. They listening Quran, they crying. They don't know meaning. Even they don't know meaning. What is the Quran telling us for guidance? They don't know meaning also. They says music is such a good. They listening, they say, we have peace. So the guy don't convert, you know, Islam, he's YouTube sign. And the guy, he told us today, Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he went with, he married with his daughter-in-law. I can say to him, Please, you not understand proper Quran. You need Muslim scholars. Yasser Khazi, he explained that. He mentioned Yasser Khazi, one name. He lived in America. The guy, he don't know Islam. Many Muslims, they hate Yasser Khazi. And they says, stop, you know, don't give to lecture. And this guy, he giving his reference. He need al Hazar. Al Hazar, Azar, Egypt University, very big Al Hazar University in Egypt. You can go Egypt, Cairo, capital, I think. So Egypt have university. If he wants to be make sure what is Islam, they can explain him. But he says, you know, Muhammad Salah married his daughter-in-law. But Quran says, whom we have to be married. In the Quran, Allah mentioned, you can't marry mother, you can't marry your sister. Like this, many, you know, Allah restrictions we have, we can't marry auntie, like that. Allah show in the Quran, don't marry this woman, Allah says. But he don't understand this point. And he says, Quran is not a, you know, a true, like, the publishers in Europe or the publisher in uh, English uh, translation, they don't know true Quran like because Allah told us in the <coughs> Quran, 14th century, single word is not changed and Allah says, I protect this Quran. 
Allah challenge for mankind. Nobody can change Quran, especially in Arabic. They have translation. That is a different story. Like you know, Shia have translation different. Khadiani they have translation different. Even in America, the Al Furqan, you know, non-believers, they want to be say, you know, Islam is not a true. They want to be say, you know, God have son like their translation in uh, Al Furqan Quran, and they says this is not the true Quran. But if you want to be know in the Quran, God have son like they want to be proof. So this translation doesn't matter. But Allah challenge Surah Ikhlas, Kulu Allah Hat. Kulauz bi Rabbi Nas, Kulauz bi Rabbi Falak, Kulauz bi. You can see four kul. Kul kul ya yul kafir. This is, you know, A to Z is a correct since fourteen, thirty nine years. Other one is Surah Fatiha. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alamin. We recite every day. This four kul we recite every day, and. Ayatul Kursi, Allahu la ilaha illahu. This recite every day, Muslims. And this is challenge for mankind. Allah says, I protect this Quran, and He wants to be say, you know, this Quran is not a, you know, uh, true, and this is not, uh, you know, hundred uh, percent correct. He wants to be say, and they have translations, and they wants to be disturb our minds. They wants to be whisper our minds. They want to be divert our minds, like. But Muslims have to be careful with these guys because one time Abraham time and Moses time also, and you know David time and Jesus time, they abuse prophets. And today also Christians abuse Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. They say sometimes you know he married six year girl and he went uh, for sex nine. She become nine year old that time. And this not a first time. The non-believers always they use bad words because they come from you know spam that he dropped that. They don't have you know pure like Prophet Muhammad Sallam body because Allah change his body. Other one is they don't understand. Well educated people in this set, well master mind in this set, doctor, scientist, you know computer minds. They have everything. But they don't understand God is unseen. Suppose everybody says God is one, so God is unseen. Allah says, "I am the sustainer. I am, I am the provi provider." Why He said that? Now you have to be understand this point. I beat every religion because they says God came in this earth. You can see technology proof God never came in this earth. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar.